giveaway for the infinity gauntlet is entering its final days so if you have not entered yet this will be one of your final chances to do so the rules to enter are as follows all you have to do is like this video subscribe turn on notifications and tell me in the comments below what your favorite marvel film is yesterday there was a q a with the russo brothers following an exclusive screening of avengers infinity war although they didn't talk specifically about avengers 4 or the avengers 4 trailer we will break down everything that they revealed and discussed at least all the major revelations pertaining to the in-universe MCU. Let's begin with a little piece that they did discuss about Avengers 4. Basically, at the end of the Q&A, all they said is that we could expect something from Avengers 4 very soon. Likely, this means the first teaser trailer for A4, although there are no concrete dates set in place for the release of the trailer. It is a safe bet, though, that we will be getting the trailer before December 5th. One of the first things that we learned about is that Hulk was actually fighting towards the other end of the Asgardian ship when Thanos first arrived. This is why when Thanos boards the ship in the beginning of Infinity War, Hulk is not present. The Russo brothers also reiterated that Thanos was able to beat Hulk without the use of the Power Stone and by his sheer strength and skill in combat alone. One of the next things that they addressed was Cole Obsidian's Sash. Many believed that this had come from Captain Marvel and marked some type of battle between the two that had taken place earlier. However, here the Russo brothers admitted that this was simply a coincidence. On a different topic, Topic, though, they addressed that Thor's new axe Stormbreaker isn't necessarily more powerful than the Infinity Gauntlet. What they did reveal, though, is that it in some way is able to counteract the Gauntlet, which of course we know is through energy absorption. They also addressed, though, that the Stormbreaker overcoming the Gauntlet was in major part due to Thanos being caught off guard by Thor. Something else that was addressed was that Red Skull was not always the Stonekeeper of Vormir. However, although he was removed several times, he was there originally and finally in the end of the film. Concerning Marvel Netflix characters, they revealed that they did discuss it, but it never really went further than that. Another one of the major reveals is that after half of the Asgardians were killed by Thanos in the opening of the movie, the Russo brothers confirmed that half of them were snapped away by Thanos. This means there are very, very few Asgardians left. Something else that was revealed is that where Thanos is at the end of Avengers Infinity War is known as Titan 2. The Russo brothers explained that everywhere that Thanos visited and made his home essentially, he named Titan. In this place, his farm being placed on Titan 2, and not the original Titan. This refers back to the theory that Thanos actually used the Time Stone or Reality Stone to go back to the original Titan, which is debunked here. The Russo brothers also went on to explain that without a doubt, Stormbreaker is more powerful than Mjolnir. And the final reveal is that Thanos does indeed use the Soul Stone at the end of Infinity War to speak with Gamora, or the Soul of Gamora. Another Another small detail, though, is that during his battle with Doctor Strange, Thanos literally used the Soul Stone to pull Doctor Strange's soul from his body, with Doctor Strange having to pull it back within himself. So those were all of the major revelations that we got from the Russo Brothers Q&A following a screening of Infinity War. Again, they didn't really speak about Avengers 4 much, although at the end of the night, they did say to expect something very soon. But leave your thoughts on this and the various revelations that we got about Infinity War and certain aspects of the film that many fans didn't even think about before the Q&A. What was your favorite Russo brother reveal by the end of the night, and when do you think we will finally get the trailer for Avengers 4? As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to enter the giveaway for the gauntlet, subscribe to join the team, and have a great day.